and Doug Brown may be wanting to freeze this moment in time. He's got a big, big lead with Plesak into the stretch, off three quarters in 124, and Plesak through the lane. Legendary Canadian driver Doug Brown is going to score the victory in the 50th Maple Leaf Trotting Classic final. A moment for all time for Doug Brown winning the 2001 50th Maple Leaf Trot. Plesak defeated Dr. Run a Rail and Dream Vacation in 153 and 2. We've got Doug Brown live here in the winner's circle as well as John Boot and Shane, the winning trainer. Doug, I know you were really thrilled to be able to see how this horse performed in the Elims. How's it feel now that you've won your first Maple Leaf trot? Relieved. <laughs> oh, what a great horse. I can't say anything about him. He's just, just powerful and, and as tough a trip as he got, and he was still so game at the wire. He's just a great horse. Were you surprised the way that uh, Tony Butt didn't let you clear to the front quite as quickly as he may have given those early fractions? Well, not really, because that's, that's a pretty good horse, and I guess he thought if he could make front, maybe he'd be able to be, he'd, he'd be the best too, but uh, it took a lot, but we finally cleared him past the half, and uh, he just, just, just a tremendous horse. You've got tears in your eyes right now. Why is this such an emotional moment for you? Well, I, I got allergies for one thing. I'm allergic to horses, but uh, it, something like this does bring a tear to your eye for sure. It's just, just a, a great feeling. That's terrific, Doug. And John, you were looking at the stretch run right now. This horse was extremely good coming in. Was he feeling as well as you had hoped at the start of the race? Oh, yeah. Um, I was real happy with the way he warmed up tonight. He was good and aggressive warming up. He got over the track wonderful. Um, we thought it would be our race to lose. We wanted to try to get to the top at some point. If somebody beats us, they beat us, but it worked out great. I mean, it was pretty stiff fractions, a little nervous, and I think I was cheering him harder than Doug was driving him down the lane. I tell you, boy, that was exciting. <laughs> There's a fellow on the pitcher's mound for the Blue Jays that recommended uh, Doug Brown as your driver? Uh, I don't know. This is the owner, Richard Baylog. Um, he made the decision and uh, said that Doug is uh, the best up here, and he's great with trotters, so we'll give him a shot. Richard, you've got a tremendous team here working for you. How do you feel about the job they've done? Well, no, it's tremendous. It's about time. Maybe we'll get some respect now. <laughs> We're from Illinois. This is a hell of a trotter, and the rest of the world should take notice, They, especially on the East Coast. In Canada, they treat us nice. On the East Coast, I don't know what they're thinking of. I want to know also, where's Varen? Varen grabbed the money, left, went back to Europe, if he looks this horse in the eye, it's a different story. That sounds like a challenge. Maybe we'll get to see it. Absolutely. Well, there, he's a coward, okay? He took the money, ran, everything worked out perfect for him. Have him look Plesek in the eye. The same as you look at the baseball player in the eye. All right, Mr. Baylog, congratulations Thank on your you. win. Thanks. That's.